Have you ever wondered why certain characters are so awkward and weird? You would be this way as well if you grew up without your mother or experienced trauma. They build defense mechanisms around their heart, mind, and soul to protect themselves. Only when you allow yourself to become vulnerable can you learn from this and grow into the strongest version of yourself, physically, spiritually, and emotionally. Aligning my mind, what I think with my heart, how I feel has been a life challenge. Did the creator of Marvel grow up without his mother? Stan Lee, co-creator of many Marvel superheroes, did not grow up without his mother. His mother, Celia Lieber, was a significant part of his early life. Stan Lee, born Stanley Martin Lieber on December 28, 1922, in New York City, was raised by both of his parents, Celia and Jack Lieber. His mother supported and encouraged his interest in reading and storytelling, which later influenced his career in comic book writing and creation. Here are some interesting and entertaining facts about Stan Lee and his contributions to Marvel. Stan's signature cameos. Stan Lee made cameo appearances in nearly every Marvel movie, becoming a beloved Easter egg for fans. His cameos ranged from a mailman to a DJ, adding a touch of humor and nostalgia to the films. A superhero himself, Stan Lee created or co-created many iconic superheroes, including Spider-Man, the X-Men, Iron Man, Thor, the Hulk, Black Widow, and the Fantastic Four. His creativity helped shape the modern comic book industry. The origins of Spider-Man. Spider-Man's creation was inspired by a fly crawling on a wall. Stan Lee thought it would be amazing to have a character with the abilities of an insect, leading to the birth of one of the most famous superheroes. The Stan Lee method, known as the Marvel method, Stan Lee would often come up with a general plot and then hand it to an artist to draw. He would then write the dialogue based on the completed artwork. This method allowed for more dynamic and visually driven storytelling. Breaking barriers, Stan Lee was a pioneer in addressing social issues through his comics. He tackled themes such as racism, drug addiction, and inequality, using his platform to promote positive change and social awareness. First African-American superhero. Stan Lee co-created the Black Panther, the first African-American superhero in mainstream American comics. The character debuted in 1966 and became a symbol of black empowerment. Writer of soapbox columns, Stan Lee wrote Stan's Soapbox, a series of editorials in Marvel comic books, where he would share his thoughts on various topics, including tolerance, respect, in the comic book industry itself. Military service. During World War II, Stan Lee served in the US Army as a member of the Signal Corps, where he wrote manuals, training film slogans, and occasionally did some cartooning. His experience added depth to his storytelling. Awards and honors. Stan Lee received numerous awards for his contributions to entertainment, including the National Medal of Arts in 2008. His influence extended beyond comics into broader pop culture. Stan Lee's impact on pop culture. Beyond comics, Stan Lee's creations have become a significant part of global pop culture, influencing movies, television shows, video games, and merchandise. His characters and stories continue to inspire and entertain millions of fans worldwide. These facts highlight Stan Lee's incredible impact on the world of comics and popular culture, showcasing his creativity, innovation, and commitment to social issues. Did the creator of DC grow up without his mother? The creation of DC Comics involved multiple key figures, not just one individual. However, if you're referring to one of the most notable creators associated with DC Comics, like Jerry Siegel, the co-creator of Superman, it's interesting to note that Siegel experienced a significant loss in his life related to his parents. Jerry Siegel's father, Mitchell Siegel, died in 1932 during a robbery at a second-hand clothing store. While Siegel's mother, Sarah Siegel, did not pass away during his childhood, this traumatic event did impact his life profoundly. Jerry Siegel's experience with loss and hardship is often thought to have influenced his creation of Superman, a character with a strong sense of justice and a desire to protect the innocent. Here are some interesting and entertaining facts about Jerry Siegel, the co-creator of Superman early start in writing. Jerry Siegel began writing stories and publishing his own science fiction fanzine, science fiction, while still in high school. This passion for storytelling laid the foundation for his future career in comics. Inspiration from movies. The idea for Superman was partly inspired by the 1930s movie serials and adventure stories that Siegel enjoyed. He wanted to create a character with extraordinary powers who could fight for justice. Collaboration with Joe Shuster. Jerry Siegel met Joe Shuster, his future co-creator of Superman in high school. 
The two bonded over their love of science fiction and began collaborating on comic book projects. First appearance rejected, Superman's first story was initially rejected by several publishers. It wasn't until 1938 that the character found a home in Action Comics 1, published by DC Comics, marking the birth of the superhero genre. Secret Identity Concept Siegel and Schuster introduced the idea of a superhero having a secret identity. Superman's alter ego, Clark Kent, allowed him to live among ordinary people while hiding his extraordinary abilities, adding depth to the character. Superman's alien origin, the concept of Superman being an alien from the planet Krypton was a groundbreaking idea at the time. This origin story added a unique element to the character, setting him apart from other heroes. Personal loss influences creation. The death of Jerry Siegel's father, Mitchell Siegel, during a robbery in 1932, profoundly affected him. This traumatic event is believed to have influenced Siegel's creation of Superman, a character dedicated to fighting crime and protecting the innocent. Financial struggles. Despite Superman's immense success, Siegel and Schuster struggled financially for many years. They sold the rights to Superman to DC Comics for just $130 and had to fight for recognition and compensation later in life. Legal battles. Siegel and Schuster's legal battles with DC Comics over the rights to Superman highlighted the need for better creator rights and compensation in the comic book industry. Their fight helped pave the way for future creators to receive fair treatment. Cultural impact. Jerry Siegel's creation of Superman had a lasting impact on popular culture. Superman became a symbol of hope and justice, inspiring countless other superheroes and becoming an enduring icon in comics, movies, and television. Superman's slogan, the famous slogan, truth, justice, and the American way associated with Superman reflected Siegel's vision of the character as a champion of good values and moral integrity, honor and recognition. Jerry Siegel received posthumous recognition for his contributions to the comic book industry, including induction into the Will Eisner Comic Book Hall of Fame in 1992. His legacy continues to be celebrated by fans and creators alike. These facts highlight Jerry Siegel's significant contributions to the creation of Superman and the broader comic book industry, showcasing his creativity, resilience, and lasting influence on popular culture.